So guys, here we are back in the uh, back in Tomb Raider 4. Um, this is going to be the Chambers of Taloon. But the thing is, I just recorded this level, but I didn't know that the Dazzle itself actually recorded commentary. So I recorded on my phone, and it also recorded on the Dazzle. So when I went to put it into Movie Maker to actually make the video, you could hear double commentary. I started out with like, hey guys, and then two seconds later I said, hey guys. It was like a big... Uh, what do you call it, like in music, it was like in rounds, it was, it was really weird, so I had to adjust settings and crap, and it should be working correctly now, I'm hoping it is, so without further ado, let's get into the chambers of Taloon, gonna come down here and freaking run this, oh please, get off the bike bar, come on, run, ha 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 ha, you can't get me, um, okay, let's get in the inventory and we're gonna ah come on Laura, it's not my fault. What the controller's not working it seems. Okay, <laughs> that was weird. Um, I actually should probably buy a new one. It's been like 12 years since I bought it. Since I, this is the original controller actually. But you know what? I'll shut up about that. It's time to shoot this guy right here with a poison arrow, and we'll come back for him before too long. We're actually gonna head into the chambers of Taloon themselves, which is this building right here. And this building actually serves the purpose of... Oh, come on, Lara. Actually, actually, no, never mind. We have to pick up some items down here. But yeah, this building actually is supposed to contain the armored miniature. I think that's how you say it, which we will meet him in just a few minutes. But it's actually a bunch of crap, and don't waste your time trying to lock him in here, because he actually gets out. Right, Lara? I don't know what you're talking about. I've never done this before. Okay. You, you keep saying that, Laura. Uh, but I'm, yeah, I'm hoping that this time around, uh, all the recording will go well. And it took me actually almost a week to get the Dazzle running. But that's what I'm recording with now, and I'm actually very happy about that because the quality is going to be so much better. And... Uh, yeah, that's, I'm actually very excited about that, which also means I can start recording, or start, uh, finish recording, I should say. I can finish recording Resident Evil 4, and that will be awesome, because that game is badass. And, I forgot, oh yeah, well, when I, when I, would, re when I would record it with the easy cap, it would always crash, and the quality sucked. So using the Dazzle will be a lot much better. And then I'll also continue with Silent Hill 2. But yeah, here we are up here. And when you actually spawn the Miniator, that's the lever you... The, <laughs> I can talk. That's the lever you will use to lock him in here, which we're not doing it because it's a bunch of crap. <sighs> okay, so... We actually have a secret to get up here. Two secrets in this level, actually. One is straight ahead. I think it counts as a secret. I could be wrong. Oh, and do you see down in the right-hand corner? There's a one of those big flying scarab things that we're actually going to encounter from here on out. Come on, make it, Laura. Yes, okay. Let's pick up. Oh, see, it spawned. Let's get the shotgun. Shoot it, Laura. Okay, cool. They're no match for my shotgun. No, I told you that, actually. She always trying to take credit for the things I say. It's not true. Yes, it is. And then we'll actually spawn another one right now, I think. Yes. Come on, I have a surprise for you. It's called Shotgun. Come on. Oh, where is it? Oh, right there. Oh, you almost knocked me off of the ledge, you piece of crap thing, whatever you are. <sighs> I'm so glad it's Friday, guys. It's been such a stressful week. And because it's Friday, that means tomorrow I'll have time to record probably some Silent Hill. Maybe even some Resident Evil. Who knows? We'll see. Um, We're about halfway done with both Tomb Raider 4 and Silent... No, not quite halfway done with Silent Hill 2. But, oh, come on, Laura. I'd say Tomb Raider will probably get done before Silent Hill... And then I'll do that and Resident Evil 4. And then once one of those are done, which probably Silent Hill 2 will be done before Resident Evil, 
like I said, I think I said this before, I'll probably always do two Let's Plays at once, and I'll have to pick another one. And I kind of wanted to do, oh, don't run into the wall, Lara. <coughs> You're steering me, not me. But Lara, you have a br what was I even talking about? I don't want to talk to Lara. I want to talk to Lara. You're distracting me from the subscribers. Go away. But if I go away, okay, I'm never mind. What was I saying? Um, I think it'd be dumb to play two Resident Evil games at once. I don't know. So we'll see. But I've had a very, very strong urge to let's play uh, Resident Evil Code Veronica X. Um, but I definitely there is. I do have plans in the future to do a blind let's play of Resident Evil Three with Jill Valentine and that'll be great come on Laura yes okay there's actually gonna be a soldier right here ah he's shooting at me you know well obviously I knew that Laura ouch even these soldiers can't they're no competition for my guns okay and that was it for the actual chambers of Taloon this what we're in right now is the chambers of Taloon Oh, let's slide down here. There's actually another secret to get around here. I'm not quite sure where. Oh, look at the bike. It's like glitching. Do you see that? It's like glitching into the... Oh, what? He's shooting grenades at us. Oh, my God. I thought I was on fire for... Oh, my God. There's another one. Run. 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 Oh, my God. Okay, that was... You piece of... Crap, soldier. I'm going to so kill you for that. Get the pistols. Okay, actually, you know what? I'm gonna save because I'm not gonna risk getting caught on fire. No, that's not gonna happen. And yeah, and in case you're wondering what that Citadel Gate save was about, that was actually where I saved the last time 15 minutes ago. But yeah, okay. No more no more grenades, please. Okay, good, he's dead. And in case you're wondering, or in case you forgot, we hit him with a poison arrow, and that's why he died so easily. Okay, you know, we want to get on the bike, and we're actually going to drive it across this pit right here. Oh my god, I thought I missed it for a second. But we didn't. I dodged it with my- Oh! Oh, you scared me. Come on, just die. <laughs> I love it. It just, like, falls out of the air. And, yeah, we actually have to go get another secret right now. I actually forgot about it on my first playthrough, so actually it was kind of a blessing that I forgot to change the settings for this. Okay. Come on, Laura. Go. God. She has to get her bearings and stuff. It's really annoying. Oh, I have to leave for work in 15 minutes, but we'll be done with that. I have plenty of time. Okay. Come on, Laura. Crawl. This, this secret actually takes a while to get to. It's, it's unnecessarily far away from every, like, from the central level. And I don't like it. Oh, every time I have to crawl out of here, I always think of Chronicles and how convenient it is just to do a front flip out of a crawl space. But that's not possible in Tomb Raider 4. I haven't learned that yet. Yes, I know that, Lara. I'm aware. Very aware. And yeah, here we get flares, large med pack, revolver ammo, and some crossbow ammo. Cool. I hope it's poison because we only have like 38 shots of poison left. Okay. Now it's actually time to head to the... Citadel Gate, I think. Yes, it was because there was the, the, the last save. I'm retarded. Okay, hurry up, Lara. Move yo behind. Oh, what? Oh, I'm so stupid. You can actually run through here, and I crawled the whole way up. That was, that was a I'm an idiot moment right there. Okay, now it's actually time to spawn the uh mini mini mi miniature. I don't know. We'll just call him the bull. Spawn the bull thing, creature, whatever. He, there he is. And he actually uh, hurts you with shockwaves that come out of that big stick he has. That's what she said. And we're actually going to ignore him for now. We're going to open this gate here. Oh, come on, Lara. Oh, my God. Okay. And you actually want to climb up the side of the ladder like this. Or else, when he hits his hammer off the ground, he'll, he will, like, knock you off. And you'll have to climb back up. It's actually impossible to get up and climb regularly. They actually, the goal of the game was to actually lock him inside the chambers of Taloon, but it's completely worthless. And this method's much easier to use. And don't bother wasting your ammo on him. You can't kill him. I know there's a glitch with the uh, motorbike, but I've never been able to uh, 
replicate it. It has something to do with like driving him, driving the bull into the wall. I don't know. You can look it up if you want to see it. Okay, guys, that was the Chambers of Taloon. We're actually going to start the Citadel Gate next time. Thank you guys for watching. Hope you enjoy the dazzle quality. I'll see you guys next time.